Today, we will discuss about the methods of preparation of alcohol. Methods of methods of preparation of preparation of alcohol. See, when we are talking about the method of preparation of a particular class of organic compound, we are testing whether we are able to prepare that class of organic compound from the rest of other organic compounds. As you know, we have alkenes, alkenes, alkynes, alkyl halides, aldehydes and ketones, carboxylic acids, acid derivatives like acid chloride, yeast also, anhydrides, and also we have organic compounds like amines, nitro compounds, and many. And we can prepare a particular class of organic compound from rest of the other class of organic compound. A difficult but not impossible. However, those class of organic compounds from which we can prepare our desired organic compound in a feasible manner, in a in the laboratory conditions that we prefer. So Today also, in this so, preparation of alcohol, though many methods are there, those methods so, which are feasible at our level that we discuss. So like we can prepare the alcohol so, from alkenes, from haloalkenes, so. we can prepare from aldehydes, so, ketones, so, carboxylic acids, so, esters, so, and also we can prepare the alcohols from amines. Now we will discuss one by one how we can do this. Number one, from alkenes, from alkenes, by hydration, by hydration. We know hydration means what? Addition of water. So in this reaction, we are adding water to the alkene. We know alkene CH2, normal C is one kind of alkene, called water, ethane. Now this alkene contains a carbon-carbon double bond, one sigma and one pi bond. And uh, this is an electron in the center here. Okay. Now this pi bond can be broken and we can air the water. So this addition of water we can do by this way. CH2 log on CH2 plus and the water has two SO4. In general, H H SO4. H plus H is minus high sulfate, sulfuric acid concentrated. So here is pi 1 and okay, becomes minus plus. So this H plus will add plus to this carbon and this bisulfate ion will add plus to this carbon divided by CH. To HSO4. This is called water. Methyl hydrogen sulfur. Methyl hydrogen sulfur. CH3, CH2, HSO4. Now then, we are giving HOS. Water boil 
you get what? CS2 OH2 CS3 plus H2SO4. Now this H2SO4 is H2SO4. It's H2SO4. Now this OH2 will have to be carbon. You get what? Ethyl. Ethyl. So what you can say, when alkynes are treated with concentrated sulfuric acid, then alkyl bisulfide is formed, which on further boil with the water gives you ethyl alcohol. Okay? Now, this hydrogen of alkyl, in first we are using concentrated sulfuric acid, then we are using what? Now the same reaction also we can do by direct hydration using dilute sulfuric acid direct. See if I take C is two downward C is two plus H plus H plus from acid. Simply minus plus H plus over minus. We get what you CH two over CH three ethyl alcohol ethyl. So this also we do. Now, if I have CH3, CH double one CH2, unsymmetric like Here, if I add H over H into some H plus, here the product will be something different. Here, we'll apply the Markovic coefficient. Because you see this is an unsymmetric alkyl. Okay? Now then, an unsymmetric region like your H was will be added to an unsymmetric alkyl. Then, the negative part of the region will occur to the carbon of the double bond having less number of hydrogen atoms. And the positive part will go to the carbon with one bond having higher number of hydrogen So, now what happened here? This one. Okay? Minus plus. So, now this OH part will come to what? This part. And this comes to what? This one. So, we get what? CN3 C H O O H O C is called what to iso propyl alpha. This is what to propyl. In this Markovic coefficient also uh, you have discussed in the first year. Okay. So addition of water to the alkyl can be done. Indirectly, that is first by treating with the sulfuric acid concentrate, then with boiling with water. Number one. Number two, also we can add a molecule of water to halkin using dilute sulfuric acid, where water will be added directly. Okay, and when we have the unsymmetrical alkyl, the addition will take place according to. Marconi Kopso rule. Okay? Now, number two. Number two, from hollow alkynes, from hollow alkynes by Nikoyophilic. 
sample based on this. So how can you prepare alcohol from hollow alkyl? Very simple. See if I take CH3, CH2, Br. Carbato, ethyl bromide, carbato, ethyl bromide. Now, if I take K of H, equus, K of H, equus. This equus K of H will give you what? A plus O H minus. Now, this O H minus is a strong nuclear fire. And here, this C3, C2, Br, this bromine having the minus sign nature. Will be chosen to be towards it. Again, what about the partial negative charge? Again, what the partial positive charge? Now, this nucleophile will attach what? This positive charge can go. So, will get what? C3, CS2, O2, plus KBR. And because here nucleophile OH minus is substituted, this is what is your nucleophilic substitution reaction. But remember, the production of this substitution will be different for different kind of alkyls, primary, secondary, and tertiary alkyls are giving the different products. And in this reaction, when we are using the aqueous KHO. There is a chance of getting small amount of ethene also in this reaction. That means when we are taking a harmonic cancer, getting with the aqueous cancer, in addition to this alcohol, also there is a chance of getting small amount of alkyl. So if you want to get the pure alcohol, this we can replace by less basic surface type of moist AG2. Here, AG2 plus H2 moist is what? Moisture, it's not water. So, moist AG2, H2O plus H2O, we get water. AgO also. Now, when you take CH3, CH2, Br plus AgO also. Okay. We will get what CH3, CH2, O also plus AgO. So, here in this case, also, there is no chance of getting the alkynes. Okay, this is how we can uh, prepare the alcohols from the hollow alkyls. Now, number three. Come. Carbonyl compounds. For this carbonyl compound, so we can prepare the alcohol so your by reduction and also by using Grignard series using Grignard series first of all we discuss how we can prepare this alcohol so from carbon compounds by reduction let us see what is reduction in simple way 
एडिशन इधर एडिशन आपको फाइट चाहिए। सो भाई मेरा टाइप कौन थी? ऑर्गेनिक रिएक्शन। सो एडिशन में से वी आर गोइंग टू एड दी हाइड्रोजन। नाउ दैट हाइड्रोजन वी मे एड इन द आटोमिक फॉर्म वी कैन टेक और यू कैन टेक इन द नेशनल हाइड्रोजन। सो वी हैव टू काइंड ऑफ रिडक्शंस। वी कैन से द मॉलिक्यूलर रिडक्शन वेयर वी आर टेकिंग द हाइड्रोजन मॉलिक्यूल अलोंग विद ए कैटलिस्ट दैट इज आल्सो कॉल्ड कैटालाइटिक रिडक्शन फॉर एग्जांपल यूरो हैज टू निकेल हैज टू प्लैटिनम और हैज टू पैलेडियम और हैज टू रुटेनियम सो डिफरेंट काइंड ऑफ मेटालिक कैटलिस्ट एंड मॉलिक्यूलर हाइड्रोजन वी कैन टेक दैट इज कॉल्ड कैटालाइटिक हाइड्रोजिनेशन ऑफ सपोर्ट और वी कैन स्टे दी केमिकल रिएजेंट सो लाइक और जिंक हेसियल सोडियम अल्कोहल लिथियम एल्युमिनियम हाइड्राइड एला एरेस करतो सोडियम बोरोहाइड्राइड एने बेस करतो एंड दिस प्रोसेसेस विल रिलीज द नेशन हैज एने सीडस फाइव मोल्स that will release nation hydrogen and that nation hydrogen we can add so these are the common reducing agent we can use but sometimes some reasons are there when we are using the catalyst specifically so this carbon compounds this aldehyde and ketones can be reduced into alcohol using hydrogen nickel hydrogen platinum we can zinc hcl sodium alcohol lnh formed and also nab is formed but specifically when we are using sodium alcohol that reaction is called bovalent blank reduction otherwise this simply we can reduction reaction Specifically, when you use this sodium alcohol, that is called part of bovalent blank reduction. Now let us uh, see how this carbon compound so can be converted into alcohols by reduction. Simply see, if I take CH3, suppose C down one O H. First name, what the name is? H down the I. एसिटाल डिहाइड एसिटाल डिहाइड प्लस एक करो एच तो ये लेके एक बाइल निकल है तो एक नाइट और एक नाइट भी ये लो एलआई एलएस कोर और एक नाइट बाट एने बीएस कोर और एक नाइट बाट और सोडियम अल्कोहल रिडक्शन इस नाम है ना जस्ट ये अलेक्सन सीएस थ्री 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 दें सी एच सी दे वन एस भी करें सीएस टू दें एक नाम इस ओ इस बॉन्ड विल बे आई बॉन्ड विल बे तो लो ओ एच वन एस भी टू एच सीएस थ्री इधर बोल ओ एच ओ प्लस ओ टू है जो इधर बाहर C three C two O H इथाइल अल्कोहल इथाइल अल्कोहल ओके एक बात है C three C double bond O C three ये बात एसिटोल सेम थिंग एच सेम थिंग बोलते निकल है तो और 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 ओके और L I L S four और करते हैं N A B S four और सोडियम अल्कोहल बिल्कुल C S three 
CH over to CT over ISO profile alcohol. So this is how we can uh, prepare the alcohols from aldehydes and ketones. You know, aldehydes and ketones are known as carbonyl compounds. So these carbonyl compounds so on reduction with the, this common reducing agents are carbonyl compounds corresponding alcohols. Ester is acting here, I got it alcohol. Ester is here, I got it on isopropyl alcohol. Okay? Now, how can you prepare this so carbonyl compounds? By using Rignard's reagent. Using Rignard's reagent. Now, what is Rignard's reagent? It is a alkyl magnesium bromide. But a CH3. This is what your alkyl magnesium bromide called our Brignard's reagent. Now, if I take some formaldehyde, this is what your formaldehyde, this is what formaldehyde, this is what your methyl magnesium bromide called by your. Vignasu reagent. Now see here, this is formaldehyde. See the one O. This is sigma and pi bond here. Now this pi bond can be shifted to the succinator. So this gain part is here, minus here, this gain part is plus here. Now CH3 MGP here, CH3. This is how you Mg Br plus C3 minus. Now this C will attach what? This one. And this will what to this plus. We will what? C H C O M G we are only his there. C theta to this carbon because this is minus one. C theta minus this C plus so this theta to this carbon. Now O minus Mg we are plus so Mg we are to O. C this is the addition product of it. Now this addition product to then on the bar. Acidic hydrolysis. Acidic hydrolysis. Here you see OMGBR. Now this will break here. Okay. The H will attach here and the OG. Obligate part. See already HCH means what? CH2. Attach what? No? CH3. So what I can write? CH3 CH2 OH CH3 CH CH2 OH plus Mg OH Now this is our direct product methyl alcohol. So formaldehyde, my derivative, methyl magnesium bromide, gives this addition product. This on acidic hydrolysis gives the alcohol, ethyl alcohol, 
and this is hydroxy magnesium bromide. Now, if I will take other aldehyde, suppose H aldehyde, then hard aldehyde, let us see. Same process. CA3, C number O, H, divide to H aldehyde plus CA3, MGBA, okay. What happen? This bond is put this place. This final will be break. This minus plus plus. Now C A three becomes minus M B R plus. Now this will add to what? This carbon and this to this one. So we will get what? C A three. Now C H C A three O. Mg we are now H O S H plus H O S you get what C A P C A two again C A P O H plus Mg O H yeah. So here we get a one isopropyl alcohol. This is a secondary. This is a secondary alcohol. So when estaldehyde it will be methyl magnesium bromide. We are getting this acid product of, and this on further acid hydrolysis is what the isopropyl alcohol is the second alcohol. Now, if I take ketone, I will get tartaric alcohol. Let us see. If I take a ketone. CA3, C number O, CA3, acetone, acetone plus CA3, MgBr. We get what? Same thing. This five one will break. Okay. Now this will be minus plus one, plus one. But this will add this one, this one. This two, this one. Okay, you get what? C A three, C C A three, C A three. O M G B R. Now H plus H O. Same thing will happen. H here. O H you get what? C H three, C C H three, C H three, O H plus M G O H two. We are. This one too. Tertiary butyl alcohol. Tertiary butyl alcohol. This one. So, acetone with the methyl magnesium bromide gives this acetone product. We some acidic hydrolysis give her the tertiary butyl alcohol, which is tertiary one. So, what we got here? When formaldehyde with the Gignard series and o, we are getting primary alcohol. When any other aldehyde Created with the Wigner series followed by a hand disease in acid medium, we are getting secondary alcohol. Now, if 
ketones will enter with ignatius and the product is followed by hydrolysis in initial medium we are getting tertiary alcohol okay so using bergner's reagent to we can get primary alcohol secondary alcohol and also tertiary alcohol from carbonyl compounds we can take formaldehyde we get primary alcohol any other alcohol secondary alcohol ketone tertiary alcohol okay so next we will discuss how can we prepare this alcohol so you know from from carboxylic acids and acid derivatives and acid derivatives so from carboxylic acid and uh, different acid levels like or uh, acid products so uh, yeast also we can now uh, prepare by reduction simply by using uh, lithium aluminum hydride okay if i take both cl3 cl1 o o s plus h simply on li as4 then what do cl3 cl2 o h plus h2 o s okay so acetic acid is what do acetic acid simply it's now hydrogen c3 c becomes ch2 and o becomes o okay ethyl alcohol finally we take c3 c down o c all what do acetyl chloride acetyl chloride h li n s4 okay bigger what ch3 ch2 water process it Well, C A P C W one O O C D S five called methyl C D. अच्छा, LI एलएस पर तो, तो C A three, C A two, O H two, plus C two H five O S. Four H. इधर आपको, नॉन इधर आपको. So from um, carboxylic acid, acetic acid, lithium aluminum hydride under reduction gives you alcohol, ethyl alcohol. From the acid chloride also we are, we are getting this ethyl alcohol. Even the hydrogen are being added here. Okay, and this becomes O2. This also we can get from yeast. Okay. Now from this yeast, when we are preparing this, preparing this alcohol. And we use this reducing agent here, sodium alcohol, instead of this one, that will also call your bovalent blood protection. So, carbonyl compounds, then your aldehydes, ketones, and also yeast also. When undergo reduction to alcohol, in presence of the reagent to sodium alcohol, that is called what? Bovalent blood reduction. 
So this also we can do by using sodium and alcohol on the bobulatum plaque reduction. Similarly, also we can prepare this alcohol from acidic anhydride also. Okay. Now, number five, on distortion 